Hi, welcome to Wine Geek Food Freak. I'm Patrick Legans, your host. Today, we're having a nice Sauvignon Blanc from Marlboro, New Zealand called The Ned. It's from the Morisco family vineyards. Uh, it started, uh, the Ned is actually named for one of the most famous mountains in this area called The Ned. It does have this Stelvin closure, so that's the screw cap. Uh, by law, in New Zealand, all white wines have to come with the Stelvin closure. This is coming to the future of the world. Uh, most corks, you know, they're from the cork tree. We're running out of cork trees. There is a bacteria in cork that actually makes five, three to five percent of all wine that have a cork in them not drinkable. Uh, there's few industries that allow this kind of waste, three to five percent knowable waste. Um, so the wine, the white wines actually last a little longer because there's no air interface between the exterior air and the interior air and wine. Um, this particular Sauvignon Blanc, I think is super pretty, very, you know, nice bracing acidity. An interesting thing about making uh, Sauvignon Blanc, especially in Marlboro, New Zealand, um, is, is Sauvignon Blanc is a difficult grape because Early in its ripening process, it has that beautiful steel mineral quality to it. And then as it ripens later in the, in the season, it develops those beautiful ripe fruits, tropical fruit flavors. So how do you get both of those things at the same time? It's usually a difficult decision for a winemaker. In the case of Marlboro, New Zealand, all the soil is clay and gravel banded soil. So in other words, the clay layer, which has water, it's cooler, it keeps the grapes less ripe. The gravel bands, that's dry and hot. That produces those tropical fruits. So in Marble, New Zealand, you get the best of both worlds. You get that steely, clean, mineral quality, and you get that ripe tropical fruit uh, developed flavor. I think they're fantastic. They're also great value again. Um, here on the show, we always like to do stuff that's affordable. You know, wine is an existential uh, experience. So if you wanna learn more about wine, hey, hello, you gotta drink more wine. <laughs> that's the good news. Uh, this particular wine, lime zest, lemon zest, and then that almost like riverbed rock kind of smell. Super crisp and clean. It's gonna go great with seafood. As always, I wanna thank our sponsor, Sidework Restaurant here in Telluride, Colorado. Uh, and always remember, drink wine with friends. Like Shakespeare said, those friends thou have and their adoption tried, grapple to thy soul with hoops of steel. Salute.